Hey, my beautiful Sagittarius Nord Nodes. It's Kim in Chantress here from Sydney, Australia. I'm doing a October 21 reading for musicians and entrepreneurs. I am actually doing it a little bit different this month. So if you don't know your North Node sign, I have put a calculator in the description box, a link to the calculator for you to work out what is your North Node. Now it may also... Uh, resonate with the sun sign Sagittarius so take whatever resonates with you but definitely work out your north node now we've got your sign here so you're definitely someone who likes your freedom you love to travel you've got a lot of knowledge and you're a guru or a teacher of some kind so what this is meaning is um you know, you have this north node in Sagittarius expressing it's a time for freedom and expansive thinking. So you may be feeling the need to explore new horizons or even relocate at this time. It is an excellent time for you to break free from environments that are restricting you and circumstances. So such as relationships that are toxic. Or situations that are not conducive to your music growth. Now, with the woman and the, the ship here, this is possibly you feeling unsettled, wanting to travel. Or this could be a female that's influencing you, partner, a sister, a friend. It's definitely uh, possibly someone you work with in your music world. Now, it will happen around the 29th day of October. A woman that will assist you in your career. And these are a lot of uh, fem feminine energy here. So maybe you need to be more feminine in your approach to um, your music, perhaps. Now, you've got the house, uh, the ninth house uh, here. Fli Philosophical growth, sorry guys, house of life for this. So this is yet yeah, uh, definitely looking at the big picture, looking at your future, all the wisdom and travelling you've done or doing and maybe someone mentoring you in some way. Now the reason I say this is because we've got the letter and the woman. Now this is a woman who's a blogger, very communicative. She may be... Um, a friend like I said or she writes the music in your life now this could be uh, news and messages coming to you it can come in the form of a note document email text message now it could be a license or a diploma certificates this could be you having those diplomas in your music now it is communication that gives um, an added meaning in your life whether the correspondence um, arrives on time is another mat matter so it could be indicating um, music uh, work related paperwork kind of thing you know like it could be um, feelings that you put to paper perhaps in your life so, you know, you could be writing this email. So what is this news that you're expecting here? Now, we do have Mercury retrograde from the 27th of September to October the 18th, which is about delays in communication. Now, Mercury is in apparent backward motion, lasts approximately three weeks, three times per year. And you have the stalk and the moon. So the stalk is you experience uh, change in your music career from plans to change of residence or uh, you know just changing your plans ahead. Now if you have been feeling a little bit stuck of late it should come to an end and things will move forward again here. However with Mercury retrograde there may be some delays here. Now this is changes you may be experiencing your music career or job. It may be a promotion that you're waiting on. Now the timing of the uh, stalk here is springtime or change of season, depending on where you live, what country you live in, and 
it could be the 17th day of October or in 17 days. So Sagittarius, what kind of improvements can you make in your life? And are you prepared for blocked areas of your life to begin to move forward again? But you've got to hold on to um, things that are about to go to the next level. Okay, so with your south node, which is about the past, this is whole, uh, what holds the rewards of your new growth. A cup that was filled in the past. The path of uh, least resistance. So something you've kept doing and something you're passionate about. Now you've got the tower and the scythe here. So this is probably a uh, representing a legal decision or a past that may have been destructive to you. Now the tower is protection, isolation and confinement, which okay, we've all been going through lately. And this is where you go down or you go to in your own place to reflect on the past to get some clarity. It may be the music company that you work for or it's your own independent music business if you're self-employed. It does also represent legal matters, court cases, lawsuits, rules, regulations. So it's timing here is uh, the 19th day of October or in 19 days. So what are you able to handle yourself from? A place of authentic power. You've got to ask yourself that. Now in the North Node in Sagittarius, we have where there's new growth coming and it is the opposite of the North Node. It's about integration of new experiences that are coming. It's about, um, it actually points to where new growth is needed and where your future lies, how you can cultivate the future by reaching out. Now you've got the mountain and the ring. So definitely, I feel like an agreement will be finally reached. The mountain's an obstacle that can slow you down until you can overcome it. Okay, so you're slowing down with Mercury retrograde anyway, but you were aware of your challenges. Delays and problems had to take place. And you may have had to lie quietly until either you had to wait for it to pass or you found another way around it. Now, it can sometimes point to an enemy that blocked you. Now they could be an Aquarius or a Taurus person. It could also represent a mountainous area, ski or mountain resort, or just a winter retreat. Maybe this has happened, been happening through winter. But this could have been uh, someone preventing you of that promotion, a setback in your career in some way. Now the timing can represent weeks or months. But you need to ask yourself here, what have you held on in the past that you can't let go of? And you need to be patient about it. Now we're looking at your fortune of, part of fortune, which is about where you're going to be, where you're going to be joyous, harmonious and balanced. It is um, a place of uh, happiness, your signature fulfillment, and the harmonic point of happiness. Now it's about your internal attitude that brings its external luck. So your positive attitude is going to shine with all the, the rays here. And um, you know you're holding these flowers and they're balanced. You're sitting on the on the bigger one here. So anything's possible for you now. Now you um, have the house here and the heart. So this is about a beloved home and family, musicians' family, homes where the heart is. This is an actual uh, house or an apartment or so forth, but it represents family, whether it, it's your chosen family or your blood family, it's your personal affairs, domestic affairs that go on behind closed doors. You may rehearse in your home. This is where you feel safe, secure and comfortable. And definitely you're familiar with the house and family and you don't want to leave them behind so for some of you it could be your home based business or your family owned business and maybe you work with your family in a music life 
So the timing of the house is four days, four weeks or months. But because you've got the mountain here, it can take a very long time, especially with Mercury retrograde. But Sagittarius, you need to bless your home and family for what they provide you. You now have a strong foundation to help you attain your music goals. So guys, that's all I have for you. I hope it helps. Um, remember Sagittarius signs to work out your north node and see what uh, resonates with you more. So thank you for stopping by guys. Stay safe. Love and blessings.